please say hello to the Canadian Tarzan, Dave Salmoni. <laughs> Good. How you say hello there. How are you? I'm fantastic. It's good to see you. Oh, look at this. We're right off the bat with the animals, now, huh? Now, in... <laughs> oh, that is a fox, People correct? don't feel this is a gray fox, which makes him unique and amazing. Why? Because they're not uh, the same as the red foxes that are a little bit more common. Mm -hmm. These guys are super cool. They're found in California. They are. Uh, and the things I think that's Backstage? Really... <laughs> yeah, well, this is where I got this one. Uh-huh. Um, but the thing that's really cool about these guys is that they're, uh, they live in trees, mostly. They, they do. They hang in trees. They can jump. They're like, they're like little squirrels up there. Are they like in in Southern California? Like, yeah. are they in our yeah. trees and we don't just don't know they're no, there? No, they're oh. just shy. They're so you know that saying, "Sly as a fox." So these guys yes. are super, super smart. So they're sly. They can they know where to go, where they're not going to bother people, and they can live off of almost anything. So they are in places where. Uh, when you say they can live off almost anything, you mean plants? Animals, they're they're omnivorous, yeah. So they uh -huh. can eat some some plants. Things okay, but, mm -hmm. uh, but they right. like to eat like rodents. But they and stuff, love a right? rodent. Yeah, you're right. And this guy, is, that's his. Now, do you tail, want to hold right? him? No, not at all. Okay, <laughs> no, let no. me show you. Now, this is what he likes. So this guy really likes it if you hold him what out he like likes. this. What I like up, is to not hold him. Both yeah. hands under his chest. Okay. There you go. Okay. There you go. Uh -huh. Now hold him like that. I'm gonna hold his bum a little bit. Why does he smell like hay? Well, he, that's, it's his bedding, so like you can actually see. You, oh yeah, he smells like hay. You're yeah. a pro, you know. Yeah, oh, see, I know my hay. hay. Yeah, you do, for sure. All right. And, and, the, and while you've got him there, I'd like to show. Oh, he, he this. is he comfortable? See, like yeah, this? He, yeah, this is actually him particularly likes this. I wouldn't say all gray foxes. These are not good pets. You don't want to grab a gray fox and have all of this, because they are nocturnal. Because they bite. Because they, you know, <laughs> they. So you can see these are like semi-retractable, uh -huh. uh, and this is what helps them climb a lot. Oh, that's great. Get it off of me, will you? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Him. All Thank right. You. Very good. Don't tell me they bite after I hold them. Well, I, I just need to know I what I'm like getting into. I feel like you need into. a warning. Yeah, well, thanks. I gotta have the warning before oh, the I animal see. actually. But then you won't hold it. Now, is this woman with you, or are She's you just the handing fox. these out? Okay. Well, I, right. I feel like anybody who's willing to hold it, I like to hand it out. <laughs> okay. You know, we gotta spread the animal love to as many people as we can. All right, all right. All right. And what do we have here? Slender build. Okay. Now that's, okay, all right. Now I'm not scared of this. Now, here, put your hand out. Okay. And see if he'll jump across. Right, my hand or my arm? Either way. Okay, he's on me. Now, I'm gonna make him so if you can see him the camera. You can. You don't have to be a pirate. You can just kind of. Uh huh. There you go. Like that. Put your arm down. There you go. You got to be perfect. a pirate. Now, I think the. Yeah, you're a pro. Now, the, the cool thing. Hopefully, you guys can see the front of him. I oh feel, hi. Oh, it's talking. So these guys are very vocal. They can say hello, pretty girl, hi. They talk. I take my word for it. Uh, which is one of the cool things. These guys can do that mimicry where they learn different languages and things. Hi, big guy. Oh, they can. Yeah. So, Oh, yeah, that's a good guy. This one's been around a clown, it sounds <laughs> like. <laughs> so they're super, they're super social animals, which uh -huh. is why they're so good at uh, vocalizing. OK. Now, you see the tip of his beak, so it looks really, really long on the top there? Yeah. It's because the slender build, they actually use that as a tool. They'll dig, and they'll find roots, and they'll find seeds. You look so comfortable. Oh, right yeah, now. I, feel like <laughs> I, I feel like I should be bronzed in Central Park right you, now. You, you, you might be deaf in one ear if, if, if it keeps going like this. Yeah, this is not bad. I'm OK with this. Okay. I could get used to this, now I guess. Give you so they they yeah. like to be scratched a little bit. See how they get the feathers up there? Like, oh, yeah. yeah. And they Isn't it weird that birds like to be scratched? Because you think that never probably happens in the wild, right? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> maybe, you know? maybe, well, maybe they would use their beak and, and, and scratch each other that way. Okay. But, yeah. All right. It's super All right. fun. No, I think we, uh, yeah, okay, now he's getting in my. Let me see if I can get him. Oh, yeah. mom, mom's gonna come. You can grab him right up. Okay, there. oh, he's about to fall. All right, there we go. Okay, yeah, great. Good. There you go. All right, thank you. And that was what again? That was a slender build cockatoo. Slender build cockatoo. Yeah, Australian guy. Oh, look at that. So now, oh my we're goodness. keeping with the Australian uh, theme. Oh, there we go. Go, go. Okay, there he goes for a little hop around. Now, grab your branch. This is what's gonna like the branch. Okay. I'm gonna try and grab him. Now, so this is a wallaby. I probably didn't tell you right off the bat. Okay. And another Australian, so the slender build cockatoo was Australian, and so is this guy. Now, if he's gonna relax there, just try to hand it to him. Give okay. Him, this just is the browse that he would it over? Normally. Yeah, sure, see if he grabs it. All right. Uh, come here, big yeah, guy. Oh, he'll grab it with his fingers. Let me, let me see if I can put it on the ground for him. Okay. Let's grab it down there. All right. Uh, there you go. Now, we'll talk about it. See Are these dangerous? They can be dangerous. Actually, it's interesting to say that, because most people don't think. So, well, I say it about every one of the yeah. animals you bring out, so. <laughs> so 
Yeah. What's interesting, if you see those big toes in the front as yeah. he's eating there, yes. uh, that's his big defense. So he uses his tail as sort of his balance. So if something comes that's going to threaten him that he doesn't like, a dog or something like that, yeah. uh, it's going to come back on its tail and use those big toes. And they're very, very sharp and they're super duper strong. So uh, if you're getting threatened by one of these guys. Stay now, away speaking from of threatened, on a serious note, these are these fires in Australia have been devastating to the animals. It's there, the worst. Like the wallaby. They say uh, over 15 million acres have been burned already. Some numbers say half a billion. Some say over a billion animals have already lost their life. Unbelievable. It's the, one of the most devastating things I've ever heard of uh, for wildlife in, in my. And so we thought it might be nice to mention that if you want to help the animals in Australia, you can go to ifaw.org and donate and, um, and help. The, look at how adorable this thing actually is. You, you can know? also uh, text Australia to 707070. It's a project that we're doing with the word Australia? Text Australia to 707070. Yep. I think it's easier the way I mentioned you, it. Your like way that. is awesome. <laughs> tell, so, tell me again what you can do. <laughs> I say go to ifaw.org to donate. And when we come back, what are we going, what are we going to bring out here, Something Dave? fun. Something fun. <laughs> Something not fun. Dave <laughs> Salmoni is here. We'll be right back. Hi, right, we're back with Dave Salmoni. The weekend is on the way, and uh, okay, so let's do this. You ready? This is, yeah, yeah, you, I guess so. You yeah. look so comfortable. And I happy. know, but this is the worst one you've ever brought. This is the, it's a there's a box back here, and it says venomous rattlesnake on it. All I'm right. I'm coming. I'm coming. Sorry. Can you just leave it in the box, and we'll take your word for it and go home? We can. We yeah. can. All right. There it now is. Now this is a western <laughs> oh. rattlesnake. Okay. okay. Now, we're now go right here, Jimmy. Right here, where my where my legs are. Yeah. And I let me tell you it. my favorite things about a rattlesnake. Yeah. The obvious thing uh, is... It's mad. Rat, it's right? real mad right now. No, it's not mad. So it's interesting. People always think of these guys as aggressive, right? But really, that rattle that you see there is him being a pacifist. He's saying, look it, I only really want to bite rats and bunny rabbits and those types of things. Yeah. So the rattle's here to say, you probably don't see me, but please listen to me. I'm here. Don't touch me. Uh -huh. The people that get bit by these guys typically are the ones that'll step on them or something because you can see here they have or bring them on a show you can yeah. see that <laughs> this guy loves to be here he's he fine. is not happy right now he is mad he's perfectly happy trust me i an unhappy snake is going to be darting off going to be you know doing nasty things this is just him being natural i'm not sucking the poison out if he <laughs> bites you so the interesting thing about these guys is that they key, key in on body heat right so you see <laughs> You can see. All right. Are you kidding me? Are you out of your mind? No. Did you see what it just did? Yeah, I did. He's all right. It made a move. He's okay. I'm just going to let you see his head Can there and see his rattle at the same time. That's just him telling you this is my space. Yeah. He, he wants to define his area and we're sure. So keep your eyes on him. Don't no worry about it. me. Now, I could show you, so he showed you his big strike there. We can sort of describe what that's for. So what he is, he's a venomous snake. He has hemotoxin, which means it'll dissolve some of the tissue that, that, that he bites into. Yeah, um, that's what, what I don't want. What he wants to do want. is he wants to hide near a game trail where a nice little rodent's going to come by, and then he's going to strike out like that. Now, do you want me to show you how he uses those lovely teeth? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, uh -oh. I, knew, I knew you were going to say yes. Here comes Guillermo. Guillermo, uh -oh, please come over here. A... This is our little... Guillermo, bring it in. Bring in the balloon. You want to come out? No. No, I'm okay here. It's like saying... a children's birthday party okay. here all of a sudden. So you got to picture him. He's hiding. It's nighttime. He's looking for some food. He's, yeah. he's keying into body heat. And then you go and you... Hi, oh. Hi. Okay, let's just get he him... He doesn't mind ready. balloons, I guess. Well, I'm huh? just going to get him ready to... A little better body position so he can strike out. He's relaxing. Okay. Okay, big guy. And there we go. And that's your big guy there. Oh! And that is... Whoa! That was crazy. Now, just a reminder that that's going to have venom on it, so don't, don't touch it. Yeah, I don't eat it. Yeah. I see a big guy. Don't try to reinflate now, it. Jimmy, you yeah. know how I always love to let you take part in animal fun? <laughs> no. <laughs> you know, we have... Are you out of your mind? Come here. All Come right. on down. Guillermo, you want to do this? Yeah, let's do it together. Come around this way. Come behind what me. What if we were to let Come this thing me. loose at the party? Now, you bowl. guys stay together. Yeah. Guillermo, go right next to, to Jimmy. Yes, yeah, stay and you guys right together. really close to me, he's Guillermo. Keying in, he's keying in on your body heat. Now, put it down. In he's front keying of him. on my body heat. Yeah, so let's go. Here you go, All big right. guy. Okay, let me just reach. Oh, 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 he made a move for it. You All right. All right. Now, there you go. Him. Give it to him. There you go. Sting the balloon. Okay, yeah. don't get close. There you go, big guy. Should we go on commercials? Oh, he missed. Yeah. Well, it's because he's actually striking for me. That's great, Dave. Go home. All right, enough. <laughs> Dave Salmoni, everybody. Puppy Bowl 16 is on Animal Planet. Oh! 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 O
<laughs> okay, we'll be right back with the weekend. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jimmy Kimmel. Give back this holiday season. Buy my new book, The Serious Goose. I wrote it and drew it. All the money I make goes to children's hospitals across the country. And if you don't support that, you are a monster.